Hi, I'm Margaret Ann Lembo, and I'm ready for providing you with the reading of the day. So I took another question from our studio audience before we hit the start button on the video today. I'm here with my Crystal Intentions Oracle Cards, which is a great companion book to the Essential Guide to Crystals, Minerals, and Stones. So this is the question on the table. The question is, I am a creative person and I really enjoy doing creative things and while I work full time right now as I continue maturing I want to start preparing and diversify my life some so that I can have a creative venture so I can have potentially in the future a full on creative business but for right now I would like to even have two jobs one is that I'm working for someone else right now plus that I could do creative things out of my own home and have um, start building my future, uh, building for retirement even, building uh, a nice business so that I still have a nice income stream and that I can work my own hours, which is really great when I feel like it, want, when I want to do it, even if it's the middle of the night, you know, when I have a creative urge. So, okay, so I, I, I was shuffling the cards while we were getting ready to press the button uh, on the on the video and I love that this is the first card that came up so I'm going to use this as the center focus this is the green tourmaline card which has to do with believing in unlimited wealth and success for all to realize infinite supply is always available and that it's very doable to magnetize ethical heart-centered business associates I mean, this is one of my favorite cards because I'm an entrepreneur myself, so I really appreciate green tourmaline. The affirmation is abundance and prosperity are an infinite supply. I am grateful for the blessings in my life. So the first thing I'd say is it's a go. If you have a great idea, do it. Start acting upon it. So that's the first thing. So maybe you're listening to this reading of the day today and you've been thinking about something regarding business. Maybe you've had an idea for a long time and you've wondered what should I do? How should I do it? Am I going to be able to do it? Am I good enough to do it? Things like that, which is a normal kind of question that you could ask yourself or feel, but in the big picture, the answer is yes, you're good enough. Yes, you can do it. All you have to do is decide and you can do it. But we're going to pull the cards. As you can see, while I'm talking to you, I'm pulling cards. And we'll see, I think, feel like we'll do one more card. And I'm not paying attention to the color of the card. I'm not looking to see what the card is about. Oops, I wanted that top card. Come back. And this is the one that wanted to come out. All right, so let's see what, let's see what we have here. So the first card is a peacock copper. And so this is about increasing happiness. And it is in the category of the happiness and self-confidence uh, color coding because it is yellow color coded peacock copper so we're just going to get them all lined up first garnet being able to stay focused mm -hmm. this is making sense to me golden topaz that wasn't one of the readings earlier today citrine also in one of the er readings earlier rhodonite that's cool a mental and emotional bodies balance nurturing people carnelian just do it that's the stone for just do it. All right, I'll make sense in a second, I promise you. So peacock copper, so, so what I've done is I'm just looking at the cards, I'm just looking at these gemstones as you get to know the crystals. Now remember, you can read about each one of these crystals in this book, so you just look it up in the book and read a little bit about it and then if you really wanna understand them, look it up in here. And I have courses online for this too, so you could take those if you want, all right. Peacock copper, you know, when I think of peacock copper, I always look at that as a very, like, almost like a palette, a palette of colors that you can choose and pick and, and make a beautiful uh, piece of artwork from. But the other thing I like about peacock copper is it's, it refers to peacock, when peacock medicine has to do with, you know, showing your beauty, showing all your talents, showing your magnificence. And um, let's see. And I do have that it's categorized in the happiness and self-confidence uh, category. So this is also about having the courage to move forward and that it's safe to show people your true colors, you know, that you are fabulous. Then we have garnet. I already talked about the green tourmaline. So the garnet is to be able to stay focused 
I love this. I stay focused on the task at hand and accomplish my goals with creativity and determination. So again, I would consider Garnet a just do it kind of card and it is in the green category, which has to do with money, creativity and motivation. So get motivated, stop procrastinating about it, I'll say to the person who asked the question, just do it. It's no reason, no, no re reason to wait. Um, my mental and emotional bodies are balanced. I attract nurturing people. You know, the, this is uh, uh, in the pink category, which has to do with love and friendship and romance. I would say that it will be important if you do venture off, for the person that asked this question, if you do venture off to do uh, solo work at home or, you know, where you're more like running your own business, is to maintain a sense of balance because staying in all the time and not interacting with others could throw you off. So you want to just make sure you have plenty of friends to interact with. And maybe don't throw the baby out with the bathwater and continue to work where you're working, even if it's less hours, because that will give you that interaction. And I'm sure where you're working, the people just adore you, so they wouldn't want you to not be part of the team. I'm laughing at myself because this person works for me. <laughs> See, I really love this person. I want them to stay here, but I do want them to be happy. Both of these, notice that was yellow. Both of these have to do with the confidence and courage to shine your light and do what you need to do, happiness and self-confidence. So visualize the self pur your life purpose, visualize yourself doing it, use your imagination, and know that you'll be supported by the people around you to do what you need to do to be happy. And you can have it all and have plenty of money, and I think it's a great idea. It's a great idea to do this. And I'll get, we're coming back to that just do it gemstone. This is for me... You know, I know that's somebody else's, uh, I think it's Nike's uh, motto, just do it. But yeah, do it. This is, uh, I keep, always keep a carnelian on my desk because I work out of my house too. And a lot of my, a lot of, because I write, you know, I have to be at home by myself. And so I can get distracted. It's normal. It's human. So my carnelian is my reminder to stay focused and just do it and get, stay on task and enjoy it in the process. So this is a stone that activates the creative mind. It literally says it on the back of the card. Activate the creative mind. Finalize projects. Realize unlimited potential. Improve visualization skills. Stimulate the courage. I like to say it that way. Courage to fulfill life purpose and potential. And it's in the green category, which is about money. Having plenty of money, creativity, and the motivation to make it so. So, I would say to this studio audience member, just do it. That's my reading of the day. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Margaret Ann Lembo signing off for today's issue of Reading of the Day.